Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome to my channel. My name is Wally. Right now, we're going to react to some Richard Pryor's another one. He's a GOAT for sure. This one right here, he's talking about prison. I never saw this one, but we're going to watch this together. Let's go. At least I don't have to look at them anymore. <laughs> I went to penitentiary. Gene Wilder, I did a movie. I went to, not me personally. I mean, I went to do a film in penitentiary. Um, <laughs> and it was I was up there six weeks. Arizona State Penitentiary. It was something. Oh, you're applauding for that? <laughs> Arizona State Penitentiary, real popular. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, it was strange because it's like 80% black people. And what's strange about that is that there are no black people in Arizona. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not lying, they bust motherfuckers in. <laughs> and I was up there and I, I looked at all the brothers and it made my heart ache. You know, it's all these beautiful black men in the joint. God damn, warriors should be out there helping the masses. And I, I felt that way. I was real naive, right? And six weeks I was up there, I talked to the brothers, you know, and I talked to them. And thank God we got penitentiaries. <laughs> <laughs> I asked him, I said, why did you kill everybody in the house? <laughs> because they was home. <laughs> I know he's like, hold up, hold up, hold up. You putting me next to murderers and killers? Nah, I need to get out. I mean, murderers. <laughs> Do you hear me? Real live murderers. I thought black people killed people by accident. <laughs> no, these motherfuckers was murderers. <laughs> I mean, one brother, his name was J-Bo. Motherfucker lift weights, he was in charge of it. J-Bo, muscles every motherfucker. Where's my man, muscles every. He was doing a sentence, triple life. <laughs> How in the fuck do you do triple life? I mean, I mean, if he die and come back, <laughs> he got to go to penitentiary. <laughs> right? I never understood when they give people 150 years, 200 plus years. Like, what, like, what you trying to tell me? They're going to come back and they got to go back to jail? <laughs> nah, I'm just playing with you. <laughs> it's a fuck kindergarten. Get your little old ass back in the penitentiary, mother. <laughs> you know what you did last time you was in. <laughs> Gene Wilder loved to jump in the middle of the killers and start talking. Hi, guys, how you doing? I said, Gene, bring your ass out. What do you think they'd do to us if we were here, Rich? I said, fuck us. <laughs> Homosexual ain't got nothing to do with it. They don't fuck you because you like it. <laughs> they fuck you just to see that look on your face. <laughs> I met one dude kidnap murder four times. And I thought three times that was your ass, right? <laughs> no. This I said, what happened? I can't get your shit right. <laughs> I'm getting paroled in two years, brother Rich. I'm on fire. Oh, you know, I got some contacts outside, you know what I mean? Let's see, yeah, I know what you mean. See, I want to know when this motherfucker getting out, <laughs> who he going to be with. And if I see him in my neighborhood, I'm just going to shoot the motherfucker. Because I do not want to be kidnapped. Take no chance, no motherfucker calling up my wife talking about send some money. Because that's really my ass. <laughs> so, well, don't fuck up the soup. That's what we're going to bury him in. <laughs> I'm going to take my chances. Cause, damn, I'm going to be kidnapped putting my hands behind my back. Because they always like to make you put your hands behind your back and shit and then fuck with you a little while. Say, <laughs> so, no, motherfucker, blow my face off with the shotgun while I got my hands on your nuts. <laughs> Get this shit over with now, you hear me? <laughs> so there'll be some evidence. <laughs> All right. well, the police come in, I open his hand. All right, this guy's gonna be easy to find. He's gonna show up to the hospital sooner or later.
And they do, they always put that shotgun on you, man. You ain't got to do shit. That's easy to say, but in real life, we all know a shotgun, your hand will automatically jump behind your back. <laughs> Even if you don't want it to, your hand say, fuck you. <laughs> it's a shotgun, asshole. <laughs> Give me that rope. <laughs> I'll tie myself. <laughs> Is this a good knot? <laughs> I mean, everybody like to be brave, right, in the real situation, but we ain't so brave sometimes, you know. I mean, sometimes you be brave. Most of the time, we just ordinary, you know. Hope we don't get in a situation where you have to be brave. That's how the Nazis fucked over people. Because most people are basically decent. Them Nazis just run over motherfuckers. Because black people always say, fuck, I'd have told them not. You wouldn't have told them Nazis shit. Because <laughs> them motherfuckers didn't play. <laughs> you be out there talking, hey, motherfucker, you Mr. Nazi. <laughs> but is this? <laughs> oh, nothing. Just, uh, just fucking around, Jack. Like them boots you got on home. <laughs> <laughs> In penitentiary, man, they got all them racist groups. Got the white groups, hate. They act like they're in New York. They got the Nazi party and uh, what they call it, the Ku Klux Klan. The Mexicans got them gangs, you can't pronounce the names. <laughs> <laughs> and they don't wear no shirts. <laughs> Black people got the mild miles. And, the Muslims, double Muslims. Them's the one you don't fuck with them, double Muslims. Cause them motherfuckers can't wait to get to Allah. <laughs> <laughs> and wanna take eight or nine motherfuckers with them. <laughs> well, I used to be a Oh man. Fast forward to today, you already know they would have canceled him for that right there. But you know, people are oversensitive nowadays. But my true people, you know, we tough in the skin. You know what I'm saying? If you like what you saw, definitely make sure you subscribe, right? Help me push out to the algorithm world. I'll see you on the next one. Later.